I'm happy to say today we are marking the first important step in an effort to increase safety, improve passenger rail service, and mitigate freight rail traffic issues in Springfield construction. This funding allowed Halverson Construction and the local unions to bring good paying jobs to the community. Halverson Construction employed over 140 local hands during the course of the project and several locally owned businesses. I'd also like to take this chance to thank the local unions, Carpenters Local 270, Labor's Local 477, Ironworkers Local 46, Smith Mason's Local 18, and Operators Local 965 for supplying skilled tradesmen to help accomplish this project in an efficient manner. The local unions worked hard with us to meet or exceed our minority participation goals. <clears throat> the current goals set by the Illinois Department of Transportation are 4.5% minority hours. Halverson Construction Company and the unions had 25.8% <laughs> minority hours during the, during the project. Before the opening of this underpass, ambulances would have to travel all the way south to, Car to Cook Street to go around a train and to reach the hospital. This route will save minutes during critical times and even could help save lives. It also provides a safer path for pedestrians across the railroad tracks. Again, a big thank you to the local unions and Halverson Construction's staff for the strong effort and dedication to meet the goals and get this project completed in a timely fashion. Number three.